Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Johnson before here bringing you guys Madden and Ultimate Team. Hopefully, you guys like today's game because um, it is pretty good. It's pretty much my uh, my start here in Madden and Ultimate Team, and also it is my sixth or fifth game. I'm currently one and four. Yeah, my record is terrible, but um, it is my actual beginning right now because I fully have a team. Like every position is filled except for my um, left guard. That's it. All I'm missing is a left guard. And uh, I, I was like, you know what, fuck it. I'm just gonna go in it. Like, hopefully my old line protect me when I'm passing the ball. So I went along with it. So wish I, I mean, I had to, just had to like freaking pray for my left guard not to let a pass rusher come in. So, anyways, um, this game, I'm not, I'm not actually the Buccaneers. I'm actually the 49ers. So just keep your eye open. You know, to who am I? I'm the guy that says Ram on top. The guy on the left side. I'm not the XD. I am Ram. Rampage. And uh, my away jersey is the 49ers. And right away, guys, he threw a goddamn pick. He threw a streak with a tight end. And I was like, that's the simplest right you can throw, yeah? But um, at the same time, you got to watch out the coverage, man. You didn't just you can't just expect someone to catch that freaking route. So, yeah. Anyways, another thing that I went wrong in my offense, guys, is that uh, my run wasn't working. So, I ended up throwing the ball most of the time since my O-line, I don't know what the hell was wrong with him, uh, couldn't cover at all. And as you watch this play right now, freaking Jeremy Macklin, uh, rumbling and tumbling and swizzling and whatever. He was making jukes, man. He was insane. He was a good receiver compared to the other two clowns that I have in my team. <laughs> you'll, you'll see right now what I mean, guys. I mean, the other two receivers really screwed it up majorly, like in the second half or in the second quarter. I forgot which quarter it was, but it was that bad. I ended up doing a field goal because I just couldn't get anything off. And I was going to, I wanted to be secure, so I ended up doing a field goal. Um, so now I'm in defense again and he there he goes again with the streaks and I was like alright I want you to throw it there again do it again let's see how far you go this time so I ended up playing I actually ended up manning the tight end and uh, now he had to throw to the slant and then right here I was going to manually cover him but he actually didn't throw the tight end in there so I'm trying to change his gaming style if you make him change in offense you got it done man that's why I got it that's why I got him a few times in offense but um, when he went in that fourth down and turnover, freaking LeGarrette Blunt fumbled. I was like, why the hell did you fumble Blunt? God damn it. It's not the first time he does that, by the way. He did it on game three also. So, yeah. And also, a plus, a big plus. He has AJ Green, Warren Moon, and Torrey Smith. Against my freaking corners of Terrence Newman and Jimmy Smith. So, it's quite equally, but I'm like thinking like he has a top receiver, AJ Green. He should be able to catch that every day. And watch this one right here. Why the hell did he miss the field goal? He missed it by an inch. He couldn't even make it. That's unbelievable, man. Right there, X and square was open, but I threw it to Harry Douglas. It was embarrassing, I know. Uh, Pro will actually read the square in the X first, but uh, the great blunt down the middle. Um, what's another thing that I wanted to say a bunch of the players that you see right here guys I picked them up uh, picked them off auction instead. I ended up not buying pro packs I actually gathered like around 10,000 coins. I picked up uh, several receivers Jeremy Macklin um, Harry Douglas Ryan Tannehill actually got it from the from the Dolphins regular season soul challenge and Right here. I don't know why I actually threw it to freaking X. I'm pretty much upset there I should have scrambled and watch this play right here. This is the one that really pissed me off why golden tate why <sighs> seriously I, I, I was thinking right there i should have signed patterson instead of golden tate so and there he goes down with the tight end again so yeah that that one's the one that actually pissed me off because i was like that should have been a touchdown or a first down and it would have got me to like 10 to 0. i would have actually made this guy quit a lot earlier but damn it golden tate god damn it right here my linebacker rubbed off the freaking catcher it was dumb but anyways yeah I was really upset at Golden Tate that time, but then Terrence Newman rewarded me with an interception, which is good. Um, you know, pretty much it was going down as I wanted to because he just kept throwing streak with the two tallest players he had. And it was not going to work against my defense because I know how to read those, man. It's just so simple. I mean, all I had to do just manually cover the tight end and just let the blue zone work on the outside. And right here, I messed up so bad, I know. Kind of a noobish move. I should have just scrambled out because he's just playing fact D. Just blitzing three, by the way, also. Right there, I actually messed up so bad with the coverage. It was just going downhill from there. I was like, God damn it. I don't want to freaking lose this game. I'm 6-7. Six, six to seven. So I started to concentrate a little bit more. I actually started doing smaller plays, like just run, run, pass, or pass, run, run. You know, just small plays um, just to, like, waste on the time and try to score uh, the most strategic way as possible, which I did. 
So, um, yeah, I mean, I was wishing for a Mod Brash and like Airblown not to fumble so badly. Ryan Tannehill is a hell of a quarterback, by the way. I really trusted a lot on Macklin, but I ended up throwing in the flats because this guy kept on blitzing so many times. So, so far, guys, I really don't have any kind of strategy going on because my running game didn't work since this guy kept on stopping it. So, the only thing I read from his defense is that uh, he kept blitzing the outside. That's why I kept throwing flats and running through the outside sometimes. And then when he, get, he got too comfortable, you know, covering the outside, just went halfback dive or halfback iso and just run down the middle with Gary Blunt. And that's what, what happened right here. You know, in the last two minutes, just run it down the middle. Like Gary Blunt runs over someone. Bam. First down. Crazy stuff, man. So yeah, the game should have been over a long time ago, guys. If Golden Tate shouldn't, wouldn't have dropped that pass, and if I wouldn't have thrown that interception or incompletion in certain routes that were pretty much wide open. So yeah, it was it was a screw up by both of us. But I don't know, guys. I'm still I'm still not 100%. I do admit it. I'm not 100%. I'm not 100% sure if I can actually go into an undefeated season like I did in the previous year with uh, Madden 25. I actually ended up going 25 and 0. I didn't put the whole series on because it was just too many games. I was like, it's too simple, man. So I ended up not doing the whole series. And right here, Jimmy Smith, the nail in the coffin, give me the win. So that's it for now, guys. Leave a subscription. Uh, let's subscribe for more, guys. And uh, leave a like. Leave me your opinion of your favorite part of the video. What's your favorite play? Whatever that I did. You know, just let me know. I'm the 49ers, by the way. I'm the one with the 49ers jersey winning 17-7. And, um, yeah, hell of a team that I have. It's just that I need to upgrade a little bit more so I can, like, have that big spark against players so subscribe for more guys so you guys want to see more of madden 15.